Naperville Central welcomes back longtime coach Bree Isaacson, who returns to the Red Hawks bench for the first time since 2012. The season opening match sends the Red Hawks to former conference rival West Aurora. The first few points of the year couldn't have gone much better for Central. Janelle Skinner serving an up on a big run. The senior delivers an ace the Blackhawks can't return. 5-0 Central up early. West Aurora would shake off the early season jitters. Abby Lizer and Allison Riggs combined to set up sophomore Kendra Battle for the powerful kill. West Aurora with a 5-0 run of its own. Grace Witchhart serving for the Red Hawks, but again it's Riggs to battle for the kill. Central's blockers can't contain it. West Aurora goes to take set one, 25-19. Red Hawks look to regroup in the second set. Alex Van Westrian bumps to Janelle Skinner, who sets up Johanna Havanar for the kill. Too hot to handle. Central now with the advantage. Both teams going back and forth on a lengthy volley. West Aurora goes to set up Olivia McPherson for a kill, but Johanna Havanar gets up for one of the team high three blocks. Red Hawks expanding the lead. Set point for Central. Olivia Richter sends the serve over. Blackhawks send it back, but Richter delivers a pass to Sarah Shank, who uses the left hand to push a shot over, forcing the error. Red Hawks tie it up with the 25 15 set two win. Shank serving early in set three. Olivia McPherson lofts back over the net. Shank to Janelle Skinner and Kayla Closet powers the kill over. Off the arm of Kendra Battle, Red Hawks take the lead. West Aurora with the serve from Chloe Myers. Central's ready for it though. Skinner with another great assist, this time to Sarah Shank, who uses the touch to place the ball into an open spot on the floor. Red Hawks are pulling away now. West Aurora fighting to hang on. Closet goes for the touch shot over the net. Somehow Kendra Battle keeps it alive with the dig. Central sends it back over, but this time it's Olivia McPherson who makes the diving dig. Battle lobs it over and places the ball right on the line. These young Black Hawks are not going away quietly. Match point for Central, another back and forth long volley. Both teams in search of an advantage. Kayla Classett bumps a pass to Janelle Skinner, who slaps one over. Black Hawks can't corral it, and Naperville Central completes the comeback with the 25 16 set three win. Red Hawks start the season on the right foot. I think as our first time playing together as like this team, I thought we played pretty well. I mean, we could have done a lot better, like we made a lot of serving errors, we could have cleaned up our server seat, but I mean that all comes with experience with each other and getting to know to play with e next to each other. Well, it's our first match, and anytime you play a first match, there's things that are going to surface that you didn't necessarily see in practice. So for us, we kind of broke down on serve receive, and when we did that, our offense wasn't as strong as what it's been. So we became limited, we set the same ball over and over, and I thought West Aurora did an absolute excellent job of playing defense. They had a ton of momentum, and offensively, they were in system for a long time. So for us, it was sort of just getting settled. We're playing on the road. It's the first match of the season, and going back to what we think is going to make us successful, which is ball control, serve receive, and defense. Defense. And once we did that, I think we kind of found our rhythm. I think it's been a really positive atmosphere. I think she's a wonderful coach. I've um, had her coach me before. I think it's really bringing something new to the Naperville Central program, and I think it's just really helping our team out. It's always exciting to have your first match be a win, but for us, it's we want to be playing our best ball in November. So right now we're going to take everything we saw today. I mean, you practice for so long without a match, it's hard to know what your strengths and weaknesses really are. So now we know, and we go back and we focus on it, and we've been put in a position where certain things have been exploited. But for us, we may take some lumps early in the season, but our goal is to sort of commit to that ball control, that defense and that serve received so that we're playing our best volleyball when it counts.